Hello and welcome, my name is Pakistan, playing some more SimCity. You meet me back in evil Pakistan where things are getting rather evil. Evil, evil. How many times do we have to say evil to prove my point? Anyway, uh, last time we left off, we built this main road and we have a few factories up here, as well as our wind power plant and some other stuff. Let's actually start playing this. Now, I haven't actually left it to gain any more money, but I'm sure that won't be a problem because we're actually getting quite a bit of money in at the time at this moment. Um, so, why aren't there houses along this road here? Because I haven't put them there. That would be the answer to that. Right, so what's everyone thinking? The bus is way too crowded. I'm calling sick to work today. Right, now that seems like a problem, doesn't it? Where is my bus depot? Yeah, okay, well, fair enough. We'll add another bus there. That should give us enough for now. I've only got 56 riders per day. And let's have a look. What are the people protesting about? People are protesting low land values. Low land values. Okay, let's check that out. Where are you? There we are. Okay, well, the, uh, there's quite a lot of high land value. I don't know why they're really complaining. I suppose we could put another park up here somewhere. Let's have a look. Bung one. Put it right there, because then it gives these guys enough room to actually expand to skyscrapers eventually. See, I don't know why they should be complaining. We've got pretty good coverage of parks. See, you've got, like, a park literally on the other side of the road, mate. What's wrong with you? Okay, what do you want? I've got a hunk of garbage here for you, Mayor. From the looks of this park, you've got nothing coming to pick it up. Let's get a garbage dump now before this town fills up with garbage. Okay can do. So I think, remembering correctly, we got a fire station, we got a hospital, and we got a police station. So yeah, this would be the last thing that we need. Now we can put this garbage dump right at the top here. Preferably somewhere where I can actually build roads either side. So let's actually... Ugh. Let's actually build that first, shall we? Let's build a few more roads, like so. I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Can't even be bothered to cut that out. You're very welcome. Uh, okay, so we'll put this here. Gee, that's going to be a bit of a pain anyway, isn't it? I'm probably going to have to get rid of the road this side. But we'll put it there. Because why not? Information. Why do I need information? Okay, that's brilliant. Thank you very much for that useless information. And um, we might as well zone a bit more industry as well. Uh, yeah. Might as well put it along there as well. Uh, why are there some abandoned buildings? What's going on? Three abandoned buildings. Where's the other one? Ah, oh, it's just a little house there. Okay. Now, everything seems to be pretty good. This bus is full. Good fire station upgrading. Roads are upgrading. What do you want? Let's get a fire alarm. Mm, don't they cost a lot to uphold, though? Oh no, 75 an hour. Fair enough. There you go. And we'll put some of these signs on here. Can't actually put a fire sign. That's a shame. We'll put a flagpole, though, because why not? Okay, what's the other complaint? Still about the buses, right? Worker shortage. Okay, well, that'll sort itself out. Uh, is this a bus depot? Yes, it is. Tell you what, we'll put another one on there. So hopefully people stop complaining. Stop complaining, damn it. And we might as well, just to improve the density, upgrade, upgrade these roads to medium density streets. <laughs> Dear God. Why is that like a separate little bit there? Weird. So let's like split these roads at the top into two. Is that medium density? No, I've already done that. Medium. Medium. It's all about the roads, as you've heard in my other Let's Play series of this. Roads are the most important bit. Actually, we could just go and upgrade all of these to high density as well, because then they would definitely start upgrading. Fuck it, let's just let's go for it. It'll be fine. There we go. I know it's a bit boring watching me doing this part, but it's got to be done at some point, and we'll never have to do it again, so it's worth doing. Hopefully we'll get the little message at the top in a minute that people have started building 
um, townhouses, and then hopefully the, the skyscrapers will follow. There we go. Right, health. Lots of health issues. Oh God, what now? He wants to do a fireworks show. Sure, go for it. Um, okay, so health. There you are. Treatment's being t treated. Waiting room capacity. So in fact, we could probably do with adding another treatment room on. Two deaths per day. Yep, that'll do. So fire service is slow. No. No, no, no. No, it's not. Don't worry. Right. So they're going to set everything on fire, which is really not helpful at all. Uh, however, I think what we're going to do... We probably could do with some roads going this way, like the main roads going that way. And I suppose we could. Let's go for it like that. Yeah, why not? Why not? There's nothing wrong with that. And in, in fact, we could even... So I don't think these guys down here are going to have enough room to expand anyway. So if we just do a bit of shifting around here... Fortunately, we are going to destroy a few things, but that's fine. It'll be good in the long run, I promise. And then we can put... A road going... Oh dear God. A road going up here. Oh, it's buggered it up now. So we can't actually do that without putting a bridge there. That's a shame. We might just have to settle with a bridge. Oh no. It's a bit of weird terrain here as well. No, I tell you what, I know it's a massive waste of money, but I don't like that road being there. So I'm going to get rid of it. Sorry about that, everyone who's suddenly really annoyed. Uh, let's get rid of some of these abandoned buildings. I know you can wait for them to be reoccupied, but, you know, whatever. Um, right. There we go. Okay. It looks, yeah. it looks as though a few people are upgrading. Which is always good. Need more fire trucks. God, so demanding! Put one there, then. There we go. Right, right, right. Why are people still unhappy? Where's the rubble? It's just the factories are having a bit of a spaz up there. It's fine. Have we got enough power? We do, but only just. Put another small one there. Right. So, so, so. How's our government doing? We've got a really small population, so we could probably do with putting down some more uh, residential areas. Maybe what I'll do then, instead, is draw a straight line like that. Or is that going to be a bit weird? We'll go up to the edge of the mountain there, and what we'll do is we'll put down some... We might as well just go straight for the high-density streets. Uh, we'll put down some of these. Hmm. These lines seem rather far away from each other. Suppose we could. Is that enough room? It's hard to tell. I could just go for it there, couldn't I? Oh, that should be plenty of room. There we go. So now, if we just run off of these, it should give us plenty of. Yeah, that that's fine. There. I think I estimated that quite well. Let me put one down here. Unfortunately, I don't think we'll be able to connect these roads up here due to the mountainside, but it doesn't really matter that much. In fact, maybe we could. It would help ease congestion a little bit, but maybe we can't do that. Yeah, that's one of the problems with this game. It's not very forgiving with um, road layout and terrain. Could put a road there. I suppose that would help slightly. Makes it look a bit weird, but whatever. Uh, okay, I'll tell you what. Let's just carry on whilst we're doing it. Let's put a straight road along here. Like so. It's eating into our money a little bit, but it has to be done. As you can see, actually, at the moment, we don't have any commercial demand at the moment uh, uh, at all. God, my brain is not working. And I know I'm now, like, putting down more commercial, but that will raise, like, later on in the game. So we might as well. 
I might just put it down these ones, and then all of the rest I might just put as residential. I'm not sure yet. In fact, actually, let's just reallocate this as commercial, like so. And actually, you know what? We'll put a little bit more. I feel as though like the main streets should be commercial. Plus, we've got plenty of room for more houses, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Police, what's your problem? Crime in progress. Okay, well, there's no problem there. That's fine. Okay. Right, what am I doing? Parks. We need some nice parks in this area. So we'll put one here. And one there. Like so. Nothing's going to be able to build on the end there anyway, so we might as well put one there. And we'll put one here. So that should raise the land value quite high around this area. And we'll do the same on this side. So we'll put one there. Uh, yeah, might as well put one on the end there. One there. It's good to stagger these, like I'm doing. Because there's no point having them all in like one row or whatever. You just get like a much more overlap doing it that way. And I know that you can um, expand on these by doing this. Someone said that. I, I'm aware. I just don't like doing it. Because there's no point, really, in my opinion. You might as well just put down more parks. And we'll expand this up here like so. Perfect. Yes, that's good. No, I actually know we do want to be a criminal nation, but I'm not going to do that yet. We might as well connect this up here. Like this. We're starting to see a bit of structure in my city now, which is always very welcomed. Oh, shit. Apart from that, that's not very good structure, is it? Okay, abandoned buildings. Let's get rid of them again. Probably factories, mostly. Oh, no, it's some... Um commercial stuff. The commercial buildings always have a spaz because um, people were too rich for their their gubbins that they're selling. Blah blah blah. Mayor, we have reports of this crazy guy that calls himself do Dr. Vu threatening the region. There's only way, one way to defeat him. Maxis Man, we have to bring him back. Okay, so this is basically the gubbins about Maxis Man. Uh, we don't actually want Maxis Man, so I'm going to get rid of that. What is this? Ah, Mayor Parky Games, I like your beard, blah blah blah. Miss Dr. Vu's... yes. Okay. Okay, so we'll have some more criminals at large, and then we can actually get Vu Tower, which is exactly what we want. Thank you for going away. Right. Now, there's a bit of a weird sort of large gap here. I don't really know what to do. I suppose we could just put... residential. Now, we don't want all of this to be... Factories. We'll go up to like here, like that. I suppose what we could do. That's plenty of factories, though, isn't it? I never had any more than that in the last game. Not, not that that means I was doing it right, but I don't know. It just. Do I need that? I'm going to leave it like that, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to zone the rest of it as. Probably residential. They're not going to be very happy, happy around there. Let's just have a look at the land value. Yeah, it's pretty low. But we could probably fix that with a park. A park or two. Like this. Has that helped? It has helped. Although I'm slightly concerned that they're still not going to get to the high land value. Maybe if we put down some of these small triple ones, like maybe one right on the corner there. Has that helped? Spread the influence slightly. If we put one... Hmm. That'll do it. I'm basically trying to spread this dark blue bit up a little bit, because what we've got at the moment is pretty awful. So if we put a park here... Oh, that makes factories happier. 
interesting. Why would that make factories happier? So if we put, just, we'll do a little test. If we put that there, does it make the people happier? It doesn't really seem to. It might just raise the land value, which is making them happier. And that would make sense. So maybe if we put one like... Yeah, it seems to be making the people happier slightly. Okay, well that's good, I suppose. Uh, we can put down a bit more over here, I think. Put down this as residential. And this, you know, this might as well be factories, but I think what I'm going to do is make it all commercial. I think. Let's just get this land value map up again. So if you put one there, it'll spread the land value up here. Like so. We could even put... No. No, that'll do. That'll be good. Yes, yes. Because when we put parks on this side, it'll sort itself out. So speaking of which, let's actually expand the road system a little bit. New office buildings. There we go. That's a bit tricky there. I suppose we'll just go up to the mountainside. There's no point putting it up the mountain. I mean, it's not going to do anything. Like You can't put buildings on either side, so there's no point. Uh, what we could do is make a road that goes like that. And then possibly even connect this road at this end. Hmm, yeah, might as well. It all eases congestion. The more you connect roads together, the better. So in fact, we could even put a road there. Just, again, to make it easier for people to drive around. And then we can fill this with... I think I'm going to fill it with just purely residential. And then put a few parks around and get the land value up. So we'll put this here. And I'm going to do exactly the opposite to what I said before and put one right there, but that's only because it will spread it massively in that area. Perfect. That's good. So they should all be happy in high wealth. Now over here, we're probably going to be running out of power fairly soon. Nope, we're okay. How about our sewage? We're okay for now. Ah, oh, nice. We've got some nice big buildings going up. Protesting at low land values. Are you being serious? Where? Ah, oh, down here. And like along this middle bit. Where are our parks? We don't... Actually, to be fair, we don't have a park down here now. So we could bung one like that. That's better. Uh, and we can probably put a small one around here somewhere. And that would boost it massively. I have a feeling eventually we're going to need to get rid of these buildings here anyway as we get a bigger town hall. So if we do that, that's going to spread that. We could almost do the same there, but then it's going to restrict the amount of big buildings we have. I'm pretty sure that as density increases, your land value increases anyway. Oh, that was good. Yeah, okay. Happy now. They should stop complaining. Right, what does this person want? Uh, can't handle the load. Will you add a garage? Yes, I will. I will add a garage. Oh, God. Right, so there we go. Perfect. Should keep them happy momentarily. They're going to get a bigger house. What do you want? Dirty villain. What I'm going to do, I know it sounds like anti what I'm going for. I'm going to add a police car lot. Now the problem with having the Vu Tower, um, I played around with this on a separate world, is the fact that it, although it's like it gets you money and it's fun and it makes all of your factories high level, like high tech level, uh, the only problem with it is obviously that there's massively high crime in the area which makes people unhappy. So the only way to counter that is to have a really strong police force which is expensive. So yeah. Although I'm going for crime, we are also going for a good police force. Right, okay, well this seems like a good place to end it. We've actually expanded the city pretty damn well. I'm liking how it looks. It looks a bit more natural as a city. I think it's because the land is a bit harsher to build on than last time. But if you enjoyed the episode and the series, then please feel free to leave your support in the comments below. And leave a like, favourite, or even subscribe if you haven't done so already. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Awkward. Awkward goodbye awkward.